So now that we talked about backing up the platform, we'll also consider maintaining the platform with fix packs and hot fixes. First, we'll look at managing fixes. So LifeRay generally provides hot fixes, fix packs, and service packs. And these are just different sizes containing updates and patches to LifeRay. Patching the system regularly brings the latest bug fixes to running instances. And bundled with LifeRay DXP is a patching tool that handles the installation of fix packs and hot fixes. So this makes patching pretty simple. Let's talk about the patching tool. It's dedicated and continuously updated for patching. It has the auto detection of the working environment. So we have to do minimal configuration ourselves. With the patching tool, it's easy to install or revert fix packs. And then it shows occasional fix pack collisions if there are any. And then it provides two levels of patching. So in the case of binary patching, the deployed portal application is patched and this is used by default. And if you're using source patching, it's possible to debug the modified source files. So when we use the patching tool, it installs, removes, compares, and prepares LifeRay DXP patching. And executable scripts facilitate patching. So on Unix, you'll use the patching tool bash tool. And then on the Windows machines, you'll use a patching tool batch script. For installing patches, there are a few important commands to know. So this is info, install, and index info. And if you type help into the patching tool, it explains briefly what all of these do. The patching tool applies fixes to fix packs automatically, and some hotfixes might depend on fix packs. The knowledge check. LifeRay generally provides hotfixes, fix packs, and service packs. And the patching tool installs, removes, compares, and prepares LifeRay DXP patches. <laughs>